CTV News with Tara Robinson and Daryl Jans. Good evening. We begin with breaking news. A tornado has touched down north of Calgary and residents are being warned to take cover. Environment Canada confirms a tornado has touched down in the Airdrie and Crossfield areas. It struck just before 5 o'clock this afternoon. These are pictures sent to us from Jana Benz in Airdrie. There we go. They show dark, intense clouds forming over the town site. Our residents were alarmed at what they were seeing in the sky. Jana Benz joins us now on the phone from her home in Airdrie. Jana, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Jana, describe to us what you saw this afternoon. Well, I could see the storm coming. I'd been watching it, and when my husband came home, I asked him what he thought the storm was doing, and he said that he thought he saw a tornado forming. And um, I looked out the window and could see what the, looked like the finger of a funnel cloud beginning. And so I grabbed my camera and I ran to the end of the block where you could see uh, where the tornado had touched down and it was um, picking up dirt um, in its path and, and forming the funnel. Now, by the pictures that we're seeing, Jana, the, 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 these clouds look awfully ominous. Do you know if there was any damage? Were there people in the area at the time? I don't believe so. I think it touched down in uh, probably a farmer's field. It looked like it was mostly picking up um, just dirt. It didn't look like it was causing any damage or um, uh, causing any um, basically harm to life at all. And you had mentioned that, that there were people driving by at the time. Is that right? Yes, uh, right past my neighborhood. The street heads up towards Crossfield. Okay, thank you very much, Jana Benz. Now, once again, a tornado has touched down northwest of Airdrie. Witnesses say it touched down in a farmer's field for about 30 seconds. No word yet on damage, but it's all part of a storm system that is moving eastward. And uh, Vicki Chase is following all of this, all kinds of weather warnings in effect. Vicki, uh, what is the latest? Well, we're watching this closely, Daryl, at around 510 is when that funnel cloud was reported just east of the Linden area. And you can see the intense cells. When you see the pockets of the reds and the purples, you know that those cells are pretty intense as far as uh, hail, strong winds, and the funnel clouds that are associated with these thunderstorms. The latest is a tornado warning still in place for this area around uh, Rocky View and continuing to push off around the Acme area as well. We'll take a look out and see where there's also a severe thunder storm watch in place. As I mentioned, the warning is near Acme, Linden, Carbon, Rockyford, Rosebud, Irkana, Bicycle, Delroy, and Dalmead, all in that tornado warning. And the severe thunderstorm watch is in place right now for the areas that uh, you can see where they have the severe thunderstorms moving through Hannah and Coronation. But we're going to watch this closely throughout the day, even though it's 20 degrees right now here in Calgary, and we are not under a watch. Those warnings still in place will drop down to about 10 degrees for an overnight low here in Calgary and then tomorrow up to 20 once again a chance of a thunderstorm what we have today is we have a little bit of wind shear and that means a jet is right over us the winds from the west in the upper levels at the surface out of the east that should not be the case tomorrow we start to see a change tomorrow but what we'll look at later on in the news the watches and warnings as they continue the true radar will pinpoint where these storms are headed and we will be a few degrees warmer I'll let you know when to expect that later on all right thanks Vicki